honored to host this morning one of South Africa's most celebrated musical groups. They have achieved so much and really taken South Africa to the world out there. So much so that uh, on his recent visit, Mr. Barack Obama, the President of the United States, actually cited them as their gift of South Africa and Africa to the world. It's lovely to have freshly ground in our studios. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Oh, oh, is it that? Is it like that now? I just asked Zolani just now. <laughs> no, no, we'll, we'll get away from that. But look at this, what I'm holding in my hand right now. Uh, fresh new album. It's so good to be holding this in our hands yes. and uh, to finally have it because it's been a while. It's been a while. In fact, uh, Kyla told me this morning as we were coming up the elevator that it's been about three months since you guys last played together. Yes, it's been about that. That's true. Or is it four even? Four it's going on four. It's actually it's going on four months. But lovely, yeah. the band is back together right now. Tell yeah. me about this beautiful album and, and I mean, what has it been like putting it together finally uh, uh, something for, for the fans out there? The, this album is, it's kind of a compilation album, sort of B-sides, unreleased tracks, oh, stuff nice. that we recorded over the course of the last 11 years, four albums that never made it onto albums, okay. and then some live recordings yes. as well. So it's like a little bit of a mishmash of everything we've done over the last 11 years. Tell me about those B-side songs. Why do they usually not make it onto the album? Is because they're too introspective, too deep, perhaps too... Aloof out there. Some of them, some of them, yes. And then, you know, at the end of the day, you can only have a certain amount of. I mean, you can have as many tracks as you want to, yes. but you want to have the album have a, a certain taste and a certain feel. Yes. And some songs just just don't fit into that, and yeah. it's not it's not because they're not great yeah. or whatever. So it's great for us to be able to release them now. Actually, because they're songs that we love and are close to our hearts. I've got no doubt that this is going to be as successful as all of your previous albums as well. But tell me this, what has been the secret to your success? Because when I look at Freshly Ground, there's always this um, honesty about the music, about the mm. group being put together that is undeniable. What do, what do you attribute that success to? I think, I think it's the enjoyment of, of playing together. You know, we, we do a lot of live shows and, and that's, that's maybe where our strength most lies, you know, is in that, in that synergy that we have on stage. And so we're looking forward to coming back on stage after, after so long, you know, it's great. But of course, at a very, at a very yeah. interesting time in your life, how's the little one doing? Yes, he's doing good. He was, wasn't sleeping very well today. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't sleep very much tonight and this morning, last night. Mommy braved it out and still came to the show. Yes. We really do appreciate that. We're going to get some music from Freshly Grounded a bit later on, but right now it's time for us to check out the box office top vibe over the past weekend. Check it out.